Hey everybody, Bill Owen from MMPC Tech. How you doing? And uh, taking Dixie out for a walk today. I think this is vlog number six. And uh, we are upon the holidays. I hope all of you have a safe and wonderful holiday and new year. And speaking of New Year's, that means CES, the Consumer Electronics Show in Las Vegas, which uh, is keeping me busy. I've got a bill that's gonna go to one of the suites there. I can't tell who it is yet because it's, well, it's under NDA like most stuff. <laughs> um, but what's really interesting is for the first time ever, really, right there, couldn't you wait? Come on, come on. The Mod Zoo is going to see yes to cover the show. Four of the Mod Monkeys I'm going to let out of their cages and they're going to land upon Las Vegas and cover the show. We've got lots of meetings already confirmed with different manufacturers. A lot of them uh, new ones that we haven't worked with yet and some of the popular ones that we've reviewed their products on the ModZoo.com. You can count on some interesting coverage from a bunch of PC hardware enthusiasts and we'll also see what other kind of interesting stuff is at the show too that we can share you. Maybe, who knows, with having these monkeys walking around Las Vegas, you don't know what else could happen. What else is going on? Oh, I need to congratulate our Modzu co-founder, Jeremy Birch, aka Eel Ambiance, because his clunk PC is on the cover of CPU Magazine this month. He finally finished it. Yes! And it's in the true spirit that I love, the post-apocalyptic, distressed and weathered theme. This isn't the first time he's done a build like that. He also did the Bio A10 build. I think that was a couple of years ago. And I've actually got video footage of that build I'm going to share with you. This is the guy behind me in the restaurant. I'm not making this up. What is that? Oh, those are bunny tracks. 
Yep. Now in my last vlog, a lot of you had asked, when are we gonna do another project build series? Well, finally we got another one in the works. And we've got a kick-ass case for it too. Origin PC has sent us their Genesis full tower. They've just started selling these full towers that they've made themselves recently. Uh, last I checked on their site, they weren't up yet, but the Genesis is going to retail for $449, and the Millennium, which doesn't have the lower section in it, will retail for $399. And Captain Curry Sauce and Mosquito are currently planning out what kind of loop they want to do, and of course it's going to be hardline. Yeah, that's how we get around in Minnesota. Remember last year the snowpocalypse that the polar vortex brought to us as our Christmas gift? Yeah, well, I choose not to remember that. So, we're going to have a build series with this Genesis. And uh, it's going to be really cool. This is a really neat case. In fact, it's the first time that the staff has all agreed that they really like it. Because everybody kind of has their own preferences, especially when it comes to what size case and system. But the response has been really good about the Genesis. Bill knows that I'm a Volkswagen guy, so the next step from a Volkswagen is an Audi. And I love, love these cars for Minnesota weather. It has all-wheel drive, all-time, quattro. It's, uh, this one in particular is a 3.2 liter motor pumping out close to 260 horses and this one has almost 75,000 miles on it and what I love about it is it's inside it's nice and clean and it just feels like you're riding a magic carpet Dixie we're being invaded by beavers check this out look at that <laughs> yep There's a lot of activity going on overnights here by the creek. Ah, that's dead. We just finished more of our machined aluminum PC case feet. We've got the diamond neural and the grooved and black anodized versions restocked finally. We only run those once in a while because the lathe is usually occupied with other stuff. So, oh and also if you're overseas we do ship all over just go to our international order page and we'll take care of you. What else is going on Dixie? Is that, a, is that about it? We're trying to navigate this trail while vlogging. Whoa! Watch it, Dixie. Keep going. Never mind the sense that you catch here. I don't see any rabbits. All right. You guys remember the do-it-yourself series that Mosquito and Captain Curry Sauce did for PC water cooling? Well, the case we used for that was the Fantex Pro that they sent me for review. It's an awesome case. The only modification I did to it was I added our first Modzu billet case badge to it. Otherwise, it's in great shape. Well, we're going to give you the opportunity, since we're busy with other things, to own the case. What do you have to do? All you have to do is just like and share this video. And in the comments, leave me a description of what you would do with the case if you owned it. Would you custom paint it? Put your own grills on it? What type of loop would you do if you liquid cool it? I'll put the deadline for your submission in the video description. And yeah, tell us what you do. And just promise us that if you win the case, that you'll post your log on the modzu.com form so we can see what you do with it. Yeah, it's a great case. But I honestly don't have the time to work on it and cases are starting to pile up in my shop, so. Oh, it's also open to all countries. So just like that plane flying overhead, 
that could be the mod zoo case headed your way if you win. Good luck.